Hey y'all, welcome back. Jeremy, editor of ShootingNewsWeekly.com, out on the range at Copperhead Creek Shooting Club with a gun from my safe that I grabbed today because I'm a bit of a gun hipster. I've been accused of that before, and this is a very gun hipster gun. No offense, Archon. It's the Archon Type B. This came out after the Arsenal Strike 1, which I got my hands on super early and geeked out about. And then Archon was in the US in Las Vegas. I think that Arsenal was designed or made or something related to Russia or Russia adjacent. This is more, man, this is like a John Wick style gun. It is designed to have the lowest bore axis basically of any pistol in history with this really high flat beaver tail and then the slide very, very low as you can see there. And if you watch the barrel, it doesn't tilt it is a straight action, and that was the unique thing about the Arsenal Strike 1 that Archon took to this gun. There's a locking block that drops out from underneath the barrel, and it just goes straight back. It makes it super, super fast, keeps all the recoil impulse perfectly in line, and then underneath the slide, too, the way the sear and the safety block and all that stuff work, super flat. As you can see, they tried to keep it as compact above your hand as possible. And that way the gun doesn't flip very much when you're shooting. It has a cool looking flat trigger. Um, that is super, super crisp. And then the reset right there, very short, very crisp, aggressive texture on the slide, big kind of oversized magazine release, which you can swap side to side. So sort of a interesting space. It's either like a competition gun you're gonna shoot really really fast or it's like that John Wick style ultimate tactical gun because you can go through 15 or 17 rounds crazy crazy fast with a flat shooting high-tech gun like this and that was their deal it is a little fat though I thought about carrying this I do have a holster for it I did once or twice but it's a thick boy so if you're carrying it inside the waistband you're gonna notice it but man out on the range for shooting it is really pleasant and you can see how flat that thing stays. I'm actually not losing sight of the front while I shoot, which makes it just so fast. Those double taps, I mean, I, I don't lose sight of the front sight. If you aren't blinking, you fire, and it, it comes back at you in a forward and backward rather than an up and down way, and that bright fiber optic front sight, and this is my preferred sight setup, a serrated all black rear and a bright front it stands out extremely well, and the amount of light on either side of the front side is perfect. It's a very well sorted gun with that short reset that's crisp. It is so fast, probably one of the fastest shooting guns that I own, and it's hard not to just dump rounds through it. It's also really cool looking, right? Very futuristic. That is a gun hipster gun. I once wrote an article that was like the top 10 guns for gun hipsters. This was on there absolutely. Maybe the original, a little more hipstery since it's not made anymore. So that just, you know, bonus collector hipster points, but very cool gun, Archon Type B. Let's get Dan behind it, see if he can shoot as fast as I can. I do like that sight. Jeremy's right, shoots really well the trigger is wonderful maybe the it's one of the best triggers i felt on a striker fire gun reset is very clean and crisp and short i like that texturing you know it looks aggressive but it feels good in the hand it's nothing that's going to tear you up i don't think um, it's where they, they put those triangles in like different directions yeah they do for depending on how the gun wants to rotate. So exactly. it, you know, if it rotates this way, the spiky point is pointing down, the spiky point is pointing up on the front strap. It's, it's kind of cool. It reminds me of the texture of a Spyderco knife, if <laughs> you guys know what that means. Anyway, that's a really nice shooting pistol. And, uh, hipster, I don't know, I'm no hipster, so I probably wouldn't recognize one if I saw one. <laughs> <laughs> but I love the fiber optic sight. Uh, Jeremy's right, this is kind of like the ultimate sight setup. I mean, hipsters for you was like listening to Elvis or whatever. <laughs> exactly, exactly. The Archon B. Hipster maybe, shoots yeah, but, you great, know, definitely. Just kind of hard to get and expensive and unique looking and unique functioning. That, yep. that's, that's your hipster stuff. I like the interesting engineering.
All right, y'all, thank you for joining us out here at Copperhead Creek on the Shooting News Weekly channel. Please subscribe. Please tell your friends. We want to bump that subscriber count so we can get more really cool guns out here to show you. Thanks for joining us again. I think I said that. Man, see you next time.